Welcome guys. On today's video, I'm going to show you how to save a view once video on your device or your Android device. So to do this, we actually need two different applications to do this. So first open Android Play Store and go ahead and type in, um, you can either go for uh, a screen recorder. Once you type in a screen recorder, look for anyone you like and download any one of your choice. I like this one actually, although that is not what I use. So um, the second one you need is actually to download um, a Vito. Sorry, I actually made a mistake. Download a virtual mobile. Download a virtual mobile app. This one, or a virtual Android app, anyone. So um, this is actually the one I use right here. So you can go ahead and install that download and install it so once you have this installed um the next thing you need to do is actually to open the virtual mobile app first so um this is it right here i'm just going to click on it so when you click on it for the first time and you click on this start virtual where it's going to boot up so immediately finish booting up every once in a while it's going to show you an option to play ads or to purchase so you can always play the ads after the ads you skip it doesn't show this frequently it only shows when you want to open and then if you are also new it's going to give you an option to actually um open one of the pre-downloaded um android version so you can choose anyone but if um you want to choose the latest android version you can go ahead and click on download and you'll be able to download the latest android version now if you have done that click on drag on your screen to display the menu area then from your menu area you actually need to add all of this application this whatsapp and some applications so click on add app and the applications are going to be shown for you so you can either scroll down or you go ahead and search for the application so on my case i'm going to go ahead and type in WhatsApp. So immediately you type um, some few key, it going, it's going to prompt um, a notification for your application. So you just click on import. So after you've imported it, it's going to show successful, but I already have this imported, so no need for me to click on it. So I'm just going to back out. And then this is my WhatsApp business. I'm actually going to use WhatsApp business for this case. So I'm going to go ahead and send message from this device to this one, just so you guys actually understand. So I'm going to send this particular video of this cat playing with a light bulb. So I just sent that. And from this video area, you can see that the video is here. If I click on this, I can easily download that particular video and play it anyhow I want. So the way video actually works is, um, the person sends the video, you'll be able to download and play the video at will anytime you want. It actually saves on your device. You notice I just downloaded that video, right? Now, if I back out and go to gallery on my virtual where you can see the image is saved right here. These are the two images I've sent so far. And this is the last one I just sent right now. So you can either play. Let me go ahead and play. So you see that it plays smoothly. So you can see image plays. So I just backed out to close it now avoiding copyright now just go ahead and back out even further go ahead and open your application so i'm going to send another image but this time i'm going to make it a view once image so i just clicked on this video right sorry video i keep saying image video so i just click on this video right you can see that is a video i just played it right now um since you confirmed that is a video i can do a view once i just clicked on this right now before you actually open a view once so I just sent the message. It's going to be displayed on the device. Um, it's being uploaded. I think it's actually, uh, it actually has quite some size. So it's not yet displaying because the image is, the image is loading up. So um, I'm just going to wait for the image to finish uploading. Now, the reason why this image is taking time to upload is because the image is large. So let me just go ahead and upload a different video for that case. I think this one is a bit light. So I'm also going to do it a view once and then click on send so i'm sending two right so one of them is going to actually arrive first so let me close this so that the first one will be easy now they are all taking time so let me just um wait for it to complete then since it's taking a lot of time. all right guys so the image has uploaded successfully now all i need to do is actually um open up my video recorder which is this but um 
if you do not have it open go ahead and scroll to your device and you click on it this is my video recorder i already have it here so i can click on it and then start recording you notice the recording is starting right now i'm going to go back to this area and then i'm going to click on the video so when you click on the video whichever video it is it's going to start downloading so immediately the video start downloading um the recording is already active do not forget so um that is just to make sure that we have the video saved so you notice it says um this is a view once message so it's more private so just click on ok so i'm going to go ahead i'm going to go ahead and start this video from the beginning so it's already recording and you can see so uh, we actually have to allow you to record to the end right you notice the recording has finished so i can always click on this area come right here i actually want to trim it so i'm going to trim it to where it started i think the video started here and i think it ended around here so i am going to start it there and i'm going to end it here so it free crop i'm using free crop so i'm just going to crop this out right this and this like this so i'm going to click on confirm and then i'm going to save it so whenever you save up videos like this they are going to be saved on your device and guys i'm actually making use of du recorder it's no longer on play store but i can download it from google so i download the apk from google and it's actually free to use so i do not pay any money for it so now um you can actually go to your gallery and then you see um i can actually see my recent video this is it right there that is the video so then the one for the cards and everything they are actually saved on the vmware let me explain very quick if you if a video or a picture is sent to you and you downloaded it on your vmware you can actually get all of those on your vmware gallery this is my vmware gallery you notice it only saved these two but it's not saved the other lady that is because it's a view once message so since i actually saved the other one it's going to be since i actually recorded the other one it's going to be saved on my phone and i hope this video is helpful guys if you have further question about this please let me know on the comment section and also somebody actually asked this question that's the reason why i'm able to make this video and also thank you guys um for supporting me i'm still appreciating my uh support my members so uh, thank you for really supporting and guys if you are new please do support by joining my membership i will really appreciate so see you guys on my next video please stay safe and peace